By popular demand, welcome to Amp Test Tuesday. We now welcome you to the test section of this disc. Warning, adjust your volume levels, adjust your volume levels, adjust your volume levels, adjust your volume levels. The DC audio 1.2K. Be 40 amp fuses. Let's see how she does. Supposed to be about 1200 watts. Keep in mind this is on a 14 volt bank with one 10 amp charger. It's not even a power supply, it is a 10 amp charger. You see three chargers up there, but that's only because one is for the 12 volt bank, one is for the 14 volt bank, and one is for the 16 volt bank, which is not being used right now. Only the 14 volt bank is being used. Just in case you're wondering why that is the way it is, um, I use the 14 volt batteries to mimic your car running. Normally they sit around 14.8 volts when there's no charger on them at all, but I keep the little 10 amp charger on there so I can keep them fresh in between runs. So it's not some crazy voltage, it's just a little bit of a charge just to keep them fresh. So in case you're wondering, there it is. Game's all set already. As you can see, the SAM did pretty well. But let's try 0.8 ohms. Now the manufacturer might not recommend anything lower than one ohm, but go ahead and try it anyways. It usually doesn't hurt to go just a little bit below. Um, I wouldn't go to a half an ohm with this amp, but definitely 0.8. Let's give it a shot and see if it can handle it. 0.8 ohms. Oh, 90. That's just from 1 ohm to 0.8 ohms.